It is D. I am here to share my side income budget for the week. And also make sure you stay towards the end because I have some happy mail. Yeah. So for the month of March, I have decided to patronize at least one woman owned business every week. And I got my first package for the first week of March. And I'm currently working on my second package for the second week of March. So, yeah, thanks so much for clicking onto my video. Thanks so much for subscribing. If you have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm hoping to get to 100 subscribers. Hmm. Maybe by April. Who knows? But, yeah. Um, so, let's get into this budget. I will say this week was really good. And I'm so appreciative of income I was able to earn so yeah let's get into it I hope y'all are doing well so today I will be budgeting for the income I will receive on March the 15th okay hopefully you can see that so I was able to earn $392 Sorry, three hundred thirty. I can't talk. Three hundred thirty dollars and ninety-two cents. <laughs> I don't know why that was so hard. So, like I said, this was a very good week. It's been a while since I made over three hundred dollars, and I made over three hundred and thirty dollars. So, yeah, exciting. So this week, I will be putting forty dollars to my mortgage. $40 will be going to gas, $39 will be going to renovation, $10 will be going towards household, $10 will be going towards car repairs, $40 will be going towards my, well, I'll be getting $4 in cash, sorry, and that will be going towards my vacation I have coming up so I can have some spending money. $33 to Todd's fun checking is getting $59.92. Y'all, um, pray for your girl. I have been out here just bawling, quote unquote, out. Um, so my fun checking is below the amount that I really like it to be, and I'm trying not to beat myself up because it's not often that I buy myself stuff. But, <sighs> yeah. So I'm trying to work through it. I know I work hard and all that stuff, but sometimes I feel guilty for spending money because I condition myself so much to save, 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 save. But this $59.92 is definitely needed. <laughs> so $10 will be going to my sister's student loan. I would be putting $20 to my stocks, $10 to HSA, $10 to IRA, and $9 to my vehicle fund. So on the vehicle fund, I am using Say the Must Challenge by Nija to track that. And for my household, I'm using Tasha's Crush That Gold Challenge to track that. And I will up th update those two challenges at the end of the month. So of this $330.92 this week, 12.09 um, went to debt, 20.55 went to savings, and 20 point, sorry, 12.09% went to investing. So yeah, I was so excited about this week's income. It's been kind of, crazy weather wise because friday it was springtime like really really nice then i woke up saturday and we got snow i was like really okay so yeah it wasn't bad though the snow wasn't bad the streets was fine but 
where I live, I either have to go up or down a hill. So usually when it snows, I usually don't try to leave the house, at least until other people have traveled the road or whatever. But yeah, it's been kind of crazy for weather. But I also did want to show y'all today is my savings challenge, my new savings challenge that I will be using and that I made and it's available on my Etsy shop, These Digital World. So this savings challenge is called Clutch Them Coins Challenge and I will be using this to track my savings for a new laptop that I want and I'm estimated to be about $400 and there are 32 of these clutches slash purchase purses on this printable and that is that means that each clutch or purse is $12.50 so I'll be starting this soon because I actually have some money coming in from preparing some business taxes for one of my clients so I'm excited about that to get this challenge started so yeah I want a new laptop I want a little fancy one that is touch screen and all that jazz so yeah, it's going to be kind of like treat yourself type thing because I deserve it. Anyway, um, let's get into the happy mail. So as I stated, uh, I will be supporting women-owned businesses at least four times this month. I've got two of them out the way. If you know anybody else, that you think I support, should support, leave it in the comments and I will go check out their website or their shop. So yeah. So I actually made a purchase from Britt from Plan Your One Life and she was so kind to include a mask and it has her logo on there. So thanks so much Britt. I was not expecting this. Make sure you go follow her. She is very informative and very nice. So, yeah. And she did include a little note, which I love. And she just thanked me for my purchase. So, yeah, that's so cute. Thank you. So, what I ordered was one of her new items, which is the Mystery $500 Savings scratch off so yeah i don't know quite what i'm going to use this for but i wanted to support her because i've been following her for a while and she is just so supportive and yeah it's all about support and i had the money so i did it so i'm going to add this real quick to my cash finder let me move this out the way real quick So this is my little purple cash binder. Binder, nothing special. I'm just, I'm just a simple person, y'all. Like really, really, for real. And I did want from a video yesterday that I posted, I did find the card and remembered where I bought this from. So the dashboard it says failure is not the opposite of success. It is part of success, and I totally love that. So I got this from the Etsy shop. It's called Crafted by K. Yeah, like I said, I think she is closed right now, but that's where I got this dashboard from. And I also want to show the cash envelope that I got from Intentional Living. And I got this a little while back. It's a double-sided one. So this side is for personal right here. And this side is for giving. So it's like a middle part in here where you can separate it so i'm going to be i was using this but i decreased my wallet size and this one don't fit so i had to order actually another one that is actually in my wallet and it's the same personal and giving but it's smaller so i'm going to probably use this when i go on vacation next month but yeah um i really love this it's real good quality so on to the saving challenge that I bought from Brit. I think I'm going to put it right here. So, like I said, I don't know exactly what I'm going to use this for yet and when I'm going to start it. But whenever I do start it, I will let y'all know. Um, I think that is it for today. 
So, yeah, if y'all could show y'all girls some love, because I've noticed that people who get monetized, they'll have, like, the 1,000 subscribers, but they don't have the watch hours. So, if y'all could just go on there, you know, when you have a little time, help me get my watch hours up. So, whenever I hit my 1K, uh, I'll be able to get monetized. So, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and share. Hit the bell button. I think I will be posting another video later on this week. I don't know what it's going to be yet. But, yeah, I thank y'all so much for watching. And I hope that y'all have a blessed day. If you have any questions, let me know. Don't forget to check out my Etsy shop, D's Digital World, to pick up any printables that you may like or may want. They start off at $1.25. But, anyway, bye. Peace.